Welcome to the Agent Program, Initiate. I'll be waiting for you inside. Follow the lights, please. Majestic, isn't it? I'm Diana. I'll take you to your quarters. Someone likes to keep secrets. Secrets are our stock and trade. Besides, from what I hear, you have a few of your own. I'm not like you, in case you're wondering. I'm in the handler program. Agents and handlers work in unity. You know the expression, know your enemy? Well, that part is my job. Knowing your enemy is only half the victory. I know. You also need to know yourself. I'm working on it. I read your case file. Impressive work. Hardly textbook, but I suppose field work never is. Tell me, what did it feel like, taking lives? Random. Disordered. Is that why you came here? Why you let us test you? Maybe I'm not the only one being tested. Well, we are here. Basic training starts at 0600 hours. I should leave you to prepare. Are you sure about this? I am. There are no second chances, Miss Burnwood. Not here. I choose him. May I inquire why? A blank slate? Antisocial? Apathetic and unresponsive? No doubt the boy shows promise, but... Perhaps I see possibility where others see limitation. Isn't that what a handler does, sir? We'll see. Anyone can kill Miss Burnwood. He still remembers nothing? If he does, he's not sharing. We will check up on his story. The hospital in Romania. In the meantime, keep him under close watch. Welcome to Advanced Mission Training. This operation originally took place in Sydney. The target was Calvin Ritter, infamous cat burglar, also known as the Sparrow. You will need to infiltrate the yacht, isolate and eliminate your target and exfiltrate, all without arousing suspicion. And remember, as an ICA agent, you are the most dangerous person in any room. But blunt force will get you nowhere in this business. And a true assassin never calls attention to himself. Good luck, Initiate. As previous tests have established, you exhibit an unusual level of enhanced sensory perception. Use your instinct now to sense the position and movement of people around you and identify your target. You are definitely not coming through here. Please, move along. He said you can't be here. As suspected, security won't allow you on board in your current outfit. We should avoid confrontation and look for another way in. Hmm, that mechanic is in your way. Sneak up and subdue him quietly. You put on his clothes. <laughs> That's a first. Might just work, though. People do tend to see uniforms, not faces. Be cautious, though. Some people are more observant than others. Not bad, Initiate. Before you move on, I suggest you hide your tracks. You have a much greater chance of success if your actions go undetected. The toilet should do the trick.
They won't find him anytime soon. This particular uniform should get you access through the staff entrance. Just nice act normal. Hold on. That mechanic with his back turned? He's what we call an enforcer. He knows his crew and he'll see right through your disguise. So stay out of his line of sight. You're in. Well done, Initiate. Right, now for the tricky part. Start by locating your target. Intel suggests he's around the bar area. Okay, make some room for this guy. Bit unstable. Oh, I thought the door was locked. Sorry. Could you wait outside? Don't... Be advised, Initiate. ICA clients rely on our discretion and do not expect collateral damage. <laughs> well, that's gonna leave a mark. Good thing we have insurance. Okay. Unlike mechanics, the cabin crew is allowed upstairs access. I see what you're getting at. Very unorthodox. I like it. Target's private deck. Now we're getting somewhere. Ah, but according to Intel, Ritter is another enforcer who picks his own cabin crew. So tread carefully. Hi.
coming in. I could have sworn it was stolen from the Stoyvastov. Oh, that's cute. The whole officer and a gentleman thing. Not gonna get you through here, though. Sorry. Move on. Stay for it, isn't it? Nice impression. If we win, you can fix me a drink. Anyway, sounds like Ritter is about to have a private meeting with the gentleman in white. This could be useful. for Mr. Norfolk, and you paid for the best. Here, pull the files for you. Not my usual scene technology. Most of my clients are art collectors. So what is it anyway? Some type of reactor? Well, uh, not just a reactor, Mr. Ritter. Hmm. Clearly, Ritter doesn't want to be disturbed. Try sneaking around the back. Oh. You're on the right track. Stay put. First, is this reactor. So we'll become the king of the world. Well, I'm rooting for you. Now is your chance. Use your silent pistol or the client will notice. Give me a second. It's just on the tip of my tongue. Could be your mother's maiden name. I've used that before myself. Your target is down. Now head calmly towards an exit. Well, Look at all those stupid snobs. They don't even know what's going on. That's why they're stuck. Watch to secure that weapon, buddy. You don't need to the red out. car marks your extra. point. Simply push the button and you're in the clear. Advanced mission training complete. And may I say, elegantly done, Initiate. I guess my hunch was right about you. I look forward to the final test. I told you he had talent. His stats are off the charts. Such skills and reflexes. They could only be the result of previous training. Power like that, with no moral restraint. He could be dangerous. I thought that was rather the point, sir. All agents have weak spots, Miss Burnwood. Pressure points to keep them in check. But this one... 
Perhaps it would be better to just... Give me a chance, sir. Give him a chance. I will take full responsibility. Very well. It's your show. Welcome back, Initiate. As an ICA agent, every challenge you face can be overcome in multiple ways. Complete this exercise again, this time attacking it from a different angle. Vary your strategy. Improvise. We will be watching. Hey, Miss...
check that out. Yeah, uh, all right. Brought K. Wait till your break to go eat it, eh? Right? Didn't he? Sunk like a stone. There you go then. You there? Excuse me. Hey. So you to make it? Yeah. Why are you not listening, you moron? It's a cop.
you just do, you moron? I just got word. Romania was a dead end. You're saying that he lied? Place is real enough. Deserted. But we found no trace that your man was ever there. Or anyone else, for that matter. Someone erased his steps. Hmm. We'll keep digging, of course. But frankly, it's as if the Earth just spat him out. Are you still determined? Does it matter? I was told there'd be no second chances. Don't believe everything you hear, Miss Burnwood. My decision stands. Very well. I'll be watching. I just got word. Romania was a dead end. You're saying that he lied? Place is real enough. Deserted. But we found no trace that your man was ever there. Or anyone else, for that matter. Someone erased his steps. Hmm. We'll keep digging, of course. But frankly, it's as if the Earth just spat him out. Are you still determined? Does it matter? I was told there'd be no second chances. Don't believe everything you hear, Miss Burnwood. My decision stands. Very well. I'll be watching. The final test is based on an authentic 1979 mission, the high point of training Director Soda's career as an active agent. The target was Jasper Knight, a famous US chess master exposed as a Soviet spy. Soda's caught up with Knight at a military airfield in Cuba and eliminated him against all odds. This will be your objective as well. Now listen carefully. ICA exams aren't normally this difficult, not only was the airfield a virtual fortress, but he even added additional guards. Sodas wants you to fail. He considers you a threat, and this way, your unfortunate exit from the program won't raise any eyebrows. Well, if he thinks we're bowing out, he is sorely mistaken. Good luck, Initiate. 
First things first, we need to gather some intel. Now, you didn't hear this from me, but I would eavesdrop on the two mechanics just beyond the fence. Jasper Knight is leaving Cuba on a Soviet fighter jet, but first he needs to test the jet's safety features. Huh. Say you could somehow tamper with the ejector seat mechanism. You could presumably get Knight to trigger his own demise. Hmm. That might just work. Right, let's get you inside. You'll need a fitting disguise. Hmm, a guard uniform sh should do nicely, but you'll need to draw him out and isolate him. something suspicious I'll keep you posted good he's distracted now's your chance Bingo. Final test is based on an authentic. First things first, we need to gather some intel. Now, you didn't hear this from me, but I would eavesdrop on the two mechanics just beyond the fence. Jasper Knight is leaving Cuba on a Soviet fighter jet, but first he needs to test the jet's safety features. Huh. Say you could... Right. Let's get you inside. You'll need a fitting disguise. A guard uniform should do nicely, but you'll need to draw him out and isolate him. Huh? Hey, you hear me? 
we might have some disturbance. Good. He's distracted. Now's your chance. And they say cash is obsolete. So, this uniform should provide access to the hangar. Good job, initiate. It's only a matter of time before Langley catches up with him. If I was Knight, I'd be long gone. If that was the plan, then Knight pulls a fast one. Now he wants his girlfriend to go with him. Across the curtain. Naturally, Kremlin says no, wasn't part of it. Agreement. Knight says he's got documents on the other side. Hmm, I see. In order to make adjustments to the jet and perform the role of safety inspector, you're going to need a mechanic's disguise. Perfect. Now be gentle. He's an actor. Right, now to set the trap. The ejector seat mechanism has been disabled. You may need a tool to re-enable it. And now, to confront your target. Knight's office should be somewhere on the first floor. Well done, Initiate. I dare say this is an accident waiting to happen. How's the mechanic? Hey, there's threads, buddy. Jesper Knight, Doing okay? Good. we gotta go over the safety protocol. Follow me, please. Oh, must we really? Is it dangerous? Well, it must be, mustn't it? Why else would there be a safety protocol? I'm not crazy about airplanes. Is it going to do that thing where it flips on its head? I don't like that one bit. Not one bit. Don't worry. You're in good hands. Um, this way. So are we doing this he or what? He does prattle on, doesn't he? Uh, you. Anyway, you're almost there, oh, no, Initiate. All you need to do is read him the instructions in the manual by the jet, and Knight will take care of the rest. Boy, is he in for a ride.
No. Mr. Knight, we did some readjustments to Whoa, the jet. Hey. And we'll need uh, to do another safety you know, check. I have a mint. You might uh, want a couple of them. Mr. Knight, we did some readjustments to the jet. And we'll need to do another safety check. <laughs> uh, thanks. Don't get too close. Thank you, but I'm not interested. Okay. Hey, Mr. Knight. Climb in the cockpit, please. Uh, all right. Easy. One, one step at a time. Step one, strap yourself in. Uh, okay, all strapped in. Step two, locate the ejector seat handle. Uh, uh, yes, we found it. Step three, pull the ejector seat handle. use a functioning jet. Good thing you didn't disable his parachute. Anyway, you did it. Excellent work, Initiate. I bet Sodas didn't see this coming. Now stay calm and head towards an exit. Congratulations, Agent. You are cleared for field duty.
I hope you know what you just did. The chopper leaves at dawn. Now get out of my sight. So what happens now? You go back into the world, disappear, stay on your own and on the move. When we need you, we will contact you. And so does. He played his hand, and he lost. He cannot touch us now. <laughs> Still, I can't believe we beat him at his own game. If you know your enemy. <laughs> Quite right. I should tell you, the trail went dead after Romania. Our team found no records of any kind. No name. Nothing. I think they called me 47. That's not a name. So make it one. All right. Agent 47. Agent 47 and Diana Burnwood are the world's top assassins working for the ICA. Unknowingly, they have been hired by a shadow client to target a number of operatives of Providence, a secret organization working in the highest echelons of power. Providence's controller, the Constant, approaches Diana and makes her a deal. Eliminate the shadow client and learn about 47's past. But when 47 discovers that the shadow client is Lucas Gray, his lost childhood friend, he and Diana switch sides to fulfill an old pact. Destroy Providence. Together, they manage to capture the Constant, forcing him to reveal the identities of the three Providence partners. Eliminate them, and the war would be over. However, the Constant has an ace up his sleeve. Look closer. In the shadows. Behind the everyday world. Beyond the headlines and the seats of power. A hidden hand. A 
kind of company known as Providence. To it, we were just assets to use and throw away, to do the unthinkable, the unforgivable, and it never gave us a second thought until now. After decades in the shadows, we are fighting back, me and 47. Much has been lost, but we are closer than ever. We trapped the Constant, Providence's chief controller, and finally learnt the names of its three partners. In their downfall, we lay the past to rest. And, just maybe, look towards the future. 37. It's time. Partners are down there. You know, I never planned this far ahead. You never do. I see someone got his memory back. Wait, is that a beacon? What the hell? Base. Alexa Carlisle's helicopter just took off. Confirm target locations, over. Diana, what's the status? Right. We have a situation. Carlisle has left the building. And I think I know why. The Constant has escaped. He persuaded one of the sailors into setting him free. And since then, he's been seizing control of Providence assets and resources. I can only assume Carlisle is rushing to contain the damage. If she slips away again... We'll keep track of her. Make sure she doesn't. Meanwhile, the plan stays the same. Your destination is the Scepter, the world's tallest building where the partners are laying low, courtesy of their host, Sheikh Omar al-Ghazali. Marcus Stuyvesant is fifth-generation old money. His family made its fortune. Welcome to Dubai, 47. Today is the inauguration of the Scepter, and the ceremony is well underway. You will find Marcus Stuyvesant near the building's signature art installation. While a paranoid Carl Ingram 
has ensconced himself in his penthouse suite, security on highest alert. Mr. Gray is already in position and ready to assist. Good luck, 47. Do you copy? I'm here. Are you in position? I'm heading towards a point of entry. Good. Get back to me when you're there. Forty-seven, use your camera and scan the lock, will you? I think I can override the window's controls from here. The inauguration is taking place close by. Once you've infiltrated it, get your bearings. I'm sure there must be floor plans somewhere. Understood. We need absolute focus on this one. If Ingram and Stuyvesant are alerted to our presence, we may lose them for good. We are so close, 47. Don't worry. They're not going anywhere.
Greetings, sir. No, it's just a precaution. I've been personally invited by the Royal Highness Omar Al Ghazali. I should have clearance. The name is Zaina Kazim. Welcome to Dubai, 47. Today is the inauguration of the Scepter, and the ceremony is well underway. You will find Marcus Stuyvesant near the building's signature art installation. While a paranoid Carl Ingram has ensconced himself in his penthouse suite, security on highest alert. Mr. Gray is already in position and ready to assist. Good luck, 47. 47. Come in, 47. Do you copy? I'm here. Are you in position? I'm heading towards a point of entry. Good. Get back to me when you're there. Use your camera and scan the lock, will you? I think I can override the window's controls from here. I'm in position. 47, the inauguration is taking place close by. Once you've infiltrated it, get your bearings. I'm sure there must be floor plans somewhere. Understood. We need absolute focus on this one. If Ingram and Stuyvesant are alerted to our presence, we may lose them for good. We are so close, 47. Don't worry. They're not going anywhere. I've been personally invited by the Royal Highness Omar Al Ghazali. I should have clearance. Lester. The name is Zaina Kazim. Sir, I understand. But you can't enter without being searched. Zana Kazim, aka the Vulture. One of the top agents working for Crystal Dawn, the Pan African terrorist organization. I almost hired him myself once, but chose the Maelstrom instead. Now, what is his business here? Standard procedure. This is ridiculous. Well, that's how it is. Think about it and come back if you want. I'll be waiting upstairs in the reception. Understood. I would like to thank my cousins, without whose friendship and influence this Listen, I want to talk to the partners directly. Make them understand why all of this is happening. And that terminal gives me an idea. There's a server room near the Sheikh's personal reception. If you can gain access to it, we might be able to recover useful intel from it. We'll have to work together to hack the system, but it's our best shot.
just gonna play. Oh, God, help. Please, help me. Come on, switch on. We've got trouble. Something shit. Help me! Command, do you read me? Over. Oh, shoot! Command, please acknowledge. Come in, command. Oh, Mr. Kazim. I'm glad you changed your mind. Arrogance can be a dangerous trait. Yes, indeed, it can. Mr. Ingram has been expecting you. Nothing we I have a conference know. room set up for you. Don't try to mess with me. Get your ass out here. Nice and quiet. Have a lovely day. Please, go in and make yourself comfortable. Mr. Ingram will be with you shortly. Let the pros Thank do you. their job. I need you to stand up. So, you're right there. Sir. Hello, Please sir. make yourself comfortable. I'll get straight to the point. I have a well, let's call it a dispute, which the Royal Highness tells me you're very capable of taking care of. Now, I've worked with your organization before, in Morocco, I believe, so I'm a little hesitant. Don't be. We do what's needed. Well, only time will tell. I have two assignments for you. Take care of the first one, and then we can discuss the bigger fish. Now, on to the first. An acute problem has been brought to my attention. Keep talking. I'll be candid with you. No one is supposed to know that I'm here. However, there's a journalist down at the inauguration, and he's asking rather intrusive questions about who's staying up here, and that is a very dangerous problem for me. Now, I want you to silence this little pain. You think you can do that? It's what I do best. I like your bluntness. This is his file. Hans looked. Pulitzer-winning freelance journalist. He's good, and won't give up until he gets the answer. She needs, and that can't happen. Consider it done. Good man. And remember, I want a picture. I want proof so I can sleep tonight. Of course. Once this little assignment is completed, come back and talk to Miss Toe. Then we can discuss the real cancer that needs to be removed. I'm sure you can see yourself out. That's Carl Ingram, Providence partner and brass bald billionaire. A legendary political fixer, Ingram is old money and as rotten as they come. Sir, just wait a second. No, you're not on the list. Can't let you go through. I'm sorry.
Sorry, but do I know you? This guy is unbelievable. Is he your mate? Don't go any further. Greetings. Hey, you! Sir, I'm sorry. This is a restricted area. Hey, something good. I just want to remind you.